what's going on today I'm back again as usual well not as usual but I'm back today anyways bringing you five things that you may or may not known about the whole Halo series so without further First off, did you know that Halo Combat Evolved was originally intended to be a Mac game, but was later scrapped because Microsoft saw this as an idea to push their new Xbox, or at the time, DirectBox, but that, that name's for a different story. Anyways, the Mac game, Halo, was originally planned in 1999, and was later switched in the year 2000 to be ported to the Xbox as a launch title. I think it was a good idea. Next up is just broken logic. First of all, Cortana in Halo 4 is portrayed as the youngest she's been since the original game, but she's older and being treated with rampancy. So how does this work? Apparently, Cortana has been getting younger and younger through every Halo game, as she, she looks younger and younger, but she's still getting older. This is basically a breaking logic, but she's an AI and can do whatever they want. Unsurprisingly, her uh chest area has also gotten bigger through the whole game. Just something to think about. Next, do you know the game Halo Wars? Maybe, may not. It was originally an RTS game planned for the Xbox 360 and was released on the Xbox 360. But before it was called Halo Wars, Insomniac planned it to have a different name altogether and had nothing to do with the Halo franchise in general. This game was also hated by fans, in fact, because apparently it went away from the series' hardcore roots. But Microsoft went up to Insomniac Games and said, We need a Halo game. You're going to make us a Halo game. And sure enough, in 2008, Halo Wars was released, was released for the Xbox 360, and everything's been history since. Contrary to popular belief, June was not a survivor Spartan from Halo Reach. He, in fact, was killed defending Dr. Hull's way back at her lab. When Emil was fighting the Covenant onslaught, trying to help UNSC and Master Chief get out of there alive, Carter crashed his spaceship into a scarab, actually his pelican for that matter. Cat took a bullet to the head, not an arrow to the knee. George blew up a Covenant ship, but then was uh, raided by a huge armada of stuff. Jun, in fact, did not survive. He th was thought to be Master Chief for some time because of his armor and similar looks and stature, but that is not true. If you read Dr. Halsey's journal from the limited edition of Halo Reach, you will see that Jun is very much dead. Now for something recently discovered. On the fifth mission of Halo 4, titled The Librarian, Chief and Fax meet with a Covenant artifact called The Librarian. She explains to him how the Didact got to where he is, and the story of the Prometheans. It turns out, half the Prometheans are forerunners mixed with DNA, the other half are actually humans that were captured and de-evolved during the forerunner human war. It turns out, Chief is already... Everyone knew that Chief was going to happen, or his story at least. This was already planned. The Covenant planned for it, and uh, the Forerunners told them to plan for it, and this is where they are now. Turns out, the Forerunners had a war with the humans thousands and thousands of years back during the Flood War, but the Forerunners de-evolved them and sent them back to Earth. That's why the Prometheans and humans and the Knights do look kind of similar. Just something to think about next time you're fighting Promethean. Think about who you're killing.